Madam Chair. Go ahead, Ms. Burns. I don't know how you set the tone in this, but the tone is very negative. And it's just not what should be happening. Not even allowing leeway for simple things like to say amen. But I do want to state, because I want the public to, to know, the results were not public uh, for the third ward race. And for the third ward race, if it had been um, approved, it would have come in with Beverly Biggs first with 337, A.C. Dumas, A.C. A. C. Dumas with 262, Richard Jones with 129, um, the late Quincy, Councilman Quincy Murphy, 193, and last would be Kerry Nelson at 135. So I do want to put that uh, on the record. I don't know where Ms. Biggs is at with her legal proceedings or if it's done. The state is not certified, I don't believe, the race yet. I know there were some issues with a couple of the precincts being balanced, so there were some issues. But I think that once we are past elections, um, and we, we are, except for the third ward, um, when it comes to uh, the, the public showed who they wanted for that, that race, right. and it would have been Mrs. Biggs. So I don't know where her legal process is at. You know, as we talk about celebrating one, there was still another one that I personally feel that the residents are being robbed of. They are. I'm done.